So guys, welcome back to Pint of History. And today I'm challenging Sam to another 60 second challenge. Now he's been close twice, but we took it to Twitter and this time he's got to do the gunpowder plot. Are you ready, Sam? Let's do it. Let's do it. Yeah? Yeah. Right. Three, two, one, go. So, 1605, the Roman Catholics in England were not best pleased with their king, James I, who was a Protestant. So they decided they would do away with him. To do this, they decided to blow up Parliament um, with the king and, and then take over the country in the ensuing chaos afterwards. The plan was put together by a bloke called Robert Catesby. Uh, he enlisted the help of three chaps, uh, one called Thomas, another called Thomas, and one called John, or two Toms and a John, as I prefer. Um, but he needed a devoted fourth member with an appetite for peril. Enter, stage left, fearless adventurer and idiot Guy Fawkes. So Bob, Guy, two Toms and a John, shittest band name ever, uh, then put their plan into action. They rented a space next to the House, of, uh, the House of Lords and started digging a tunnel underneath it to put some bombs in. After spending ages digging this tunnel, somebody told them that they, there was just a space they could rent underneath the House of Lords. They did that instead. Like I said, sharp as a loaf of bread, these clowns. So uh, with everything in place, uh, Guy went off to France to try and drum up some support for the uprising that he'd need to spring into action after the big explosion. The problem with trying to advertise treasonous plots is people tend to hear about them, and it didn't take too long for someone, probably Lord Montague, to, uh, to tell the king. So on the night of the 4th of November, the king's men went in, uh, into the cellar, under the House of Lords, and arrested Fawkes, who was stupid enough to be there thinking it needed guarding. Uh, so a short chase happened, uh, and the others were effectively caught because Fawkes uh, started squawking when he was uh, tortured. Uh, they all died for various reasons. Uh, and now many years later, for reasons I can't really comprehend, we now burn piles of wood and set fireworks up in the air to piss off all the neighbourhood dogs on the 5th of November. So there we are, the gunpowder pot. A waste of time that's been wasting time for the last 416 years.